make the recording. Okay, this meeting is being recorded. So the very first thing here is the picture. Picture. So here, you you just you are saying to me that uh, when you are saying that the boy is sleeping, okay, the boy isn't sleeping. Sorry, the boy is lying on his bed, and that the dog is sitting on on the bed, and the cat is sitting on the floor. So when you see or okay, get the dog or the cat just sit, just stands, okay, you just have a standstill because when when the cat stands there, it means that the cat or the dog or things, okay, or something doesn't doesn't move, okay. So here, when things doesn't, the one thing doesn't move, and it is just like this, okay. You can say that it stands there, or it sits there, or you can say that uh, to be frozen. Like for example, I am talking to you right now, and I'm just like this, so it means that I am frozen. So, but uh, for the very first time uh, studying with me, do you understand what I say? Yes. Yes, very good, I think. But so here, you use the word boring. You say that, oh, when I look at the picture, I feel very boring. Are you sure that this is the right word for you to use? It is, is that the right word? Bore. Bore. Very good, okay. So here, we are going to use the word bore. So here, bore. You use the word bore, but in spoken English, especially we are studying for IELTS, okay, 4.5, uh, for, uh, or IELTS 5, 5.5 for the very first time. So don't, don't, don't give one word, okay, when you describe the picture, just say that uh, the boy looks uh, very bored and tell me the reason why. So right now, uh, but describe the boy's action. What is the boy doing in the picture? What is, okay, the boy doing in the picture? Uh, the boy is lying in the bed. Is the boy is lying in the bed? And can you spell the action verb? Okay, lie lying on something. Okay, for me, lie lying. Okay, lie lie lie. So, so can you spell the word for me? Can 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 you spell the word for me? L Y Y. Yes. Uh, L I Y. <laughs> Uh, L I don't remember. You don't really remember. Oh, it's okay. Uh, L I E. Okay, this is the verb. You are going to lie in something, or you are going to lie on something. And of course, when you remember this word, please remember the situation of this word. Usually, we say that I want to lie on my bed, okay, because I want to sleep. For example, and here. Here, to be more specific, you said that the boy is lying on his back. And where where is he laying his head on? So here, my, my second question, where is he laying his head on? Where is he laying his head on? To lay head on something. I'm going to lay, okay, my head, okay, on something. So can you share with me? Where is he laying his head on? This one, this one, what, so what do you call this one in English? Cushion. Cushion. <laughs> okay, cushion. So, so can you spell the word cushion for me? Uh. Yeah, so here, so let me help you, okay? It's okay. It's cushion. You use the word cushion, but in fact, this is called cushion. 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 Only I mean, two syllables. And for the cushion, okay, we are going to lay our head on the cushion so what about something that we hold what is the thing okay what is the thing what is the thing that that you hold that you hold when you go when sleeping so what is the thing that you hold when you're sleeping the thing the thing that you hold when, when you go sleeping for example i can show you this one uh look look let's just look at this picture oh i have so many steps on here so here, I had to work like uh, here, pillow. So here is, it is, it is called a pillow. But usually, we are going to use the pillow okay, to hold and to go to bed. And that is a very long pillow in Vietnam. In Vietnam, we have a very long pillow and we can use the long pillow to, to feel cozy and to chill out uh, in the evening. 
So here you have the word, the first word that is caution. For the second word, you have the word like long pillow, okay? So I'm going to lay my head on the cushion and just look at the boy here right now. So the boy is checking out what, okay? Uh, but please pay attention. Yes. Yeah. So what is he checking up on? What is he checking up on? What is he? The message. Sorry, sorry, can you say it again? Where is Jack? Uh, Messen. Messen. Oh, oh wow. <laughs> wow, yeah. Okay, it's okay, man. Uh, Messen. You say Messen. No, 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 it's not right. It's called Message. Message. Can you say it again for me, please? Message. message. A very good message. And this is not the, the word message. It's so general. Something general is like that. Well, for example, I asked you like, oh, when have you done your homework? You say, yeah, but you don't give me the full answer. You don't give me details. You don't give me enough or lots of information. So uh, I can say that you know, your information is very general. And here I, w I need a detailed, I need a detailed, I need a detailed information or I need a specific information. So right here, you say you are saying that he's checking up on message but what kind of message are you referring to when what kind of message are you referring to what kind of message are you are you referring to referring like you uh, refer to okay you can say that oh i want to i am talking about one story and the story refers to something or I'm talking about the story the story is about something but please pay attention okay so if you say that uh, something is about something else okay or something okay refer to something else it means that uh, what what is the story about the story is about my boyfriend the story about my girlfriend uh, uh, oh, okay so so right now do you understand what we refer to Yes. Yes, very good. And the difference between the word refer to and about something. Here, you can use like this. For refer to, you can see that this is the action verb. Okay? This is the action verb in English. For about, you can use about with um, his R. So for the very first time. So here, I want you to give me an example for about. And here, I want you to give me an example for refer to. So right now, can you think for me an example of one? Right now, can you think for me an example? You think about the story, you think about the conversation, you think about the talk, for example. Uh, to be. Yeah, to be, to be here. So when I write to be here, what does it mean? When I write to be, but what does it mean when I write to be? To be, okay, for I Armies are very good, okay? So can you give me a situation in which you can use the word about? We only think about the word about when we talk, when we discuss, okay? Do you remember this word? Talk, yeah, discuss, yeah, right? yeah. or yeah. yes, or read, okay? So first, yeah, let's say this one. So first, I want you to give me an example with the word talk, okay, with somebody about something. Talk with somebody about something. Can you give me a, a situation? Uh, I talk with my mom about my study. Oh, very good. I, sh I talk with my mom, okay, about my studying, okay, about my studying, very good. And discuss, okay. If, for example, you can say that I'm going to discuss with okay, somebody, but discuss. We don't use about for discuss. We must learn by heart this word. Discuss with somebody about something. So what do you usually discuss with your friends? Okay, what do you usually discuss with your friends? Yeah, what do you discuss with your friends? Yeah, oh, you, if you are talking about school, but you should think sure. about uh, great, great teachers, okay, other friends, okay, other friends, 
are subjects. Okay, subjects are school report. School report. So here, here are my ideas. So, so when it comes to school, what do you usually discuss with your friends when it comes to school? Right. Your friends, right, friends. And you are you are saying to me that I will discuss with my friends on other friends, okay? But but yeah. here, why why do you choose okay to talk about other friends when it comes to school? Why do you choose to discuss other friends when it comes to school? So they this is the way that we speak, okay? So we look uh, sorry, not learn. But when you start to talk. Uh, you want me to know that what you are what you are going to talk about. You are going to use the first light when it comes to something. When it comes to something, okay. And then the sentence at the end, like when it comes to studying, I feel very tired. When it comes to going to the supermarket, I feel very fun and, and cool. When it comes. Yeah. Talking with my mom, I feel very stressed. Okay, so the way that you are going to advance your English here is use the phrase when it comes to blah blah blah. Okay, and then your action. Okay, at the end. So right here, tell me. Okay, share with me. Why do you choose to discuss? Okay, all the friends when it comes to school. Why? Can say again, teacher. Yeah, sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm listening. You can say it again. Very good. So my, my question here is, why do you choose to discuss school, okay? Why, why do you choose to discuss friends when it comes to school? Why do you choose, why do you choose to discuss, okay, friends when it comes to school? When it comes to school? Why, why so? Uh... Yeah. You you can say that the friends are a what? Friends are what? Uh. Oh, you can say that. Oh, when I talk about my friends, or when I discuss, okay, friendship, it is very interesting. So here are the adjectives that you are going to use when you are talking, okay? The first one, interesting, interesting. But in fact, it is, it is pronounced a interesting in English. Or you can use the word, oh, very exciting topic. I love this topic, okay? Or very fun. When, when I talk about my friends, I feel very fun. Or I feel very happy when I talk about my friend. Or, Instead of using the word happy, you can use the second word with have the same meaning, okay? Please, I feel pleased when I talk about my friends. I feel happy when I talk about my friends. I feel very interesting when I discuss other friends with my friends, okay? So here, what are your, what are your feelings when, when you discuss, okay, friendship at school? What are your feelings when, when, when you discuss friendship at school? In Interesting. Very good. Okay, you say that. Interesting. Okay, interesting. And when you feel interesting, okay, do you want to talk to your friend more? But do you want to yeah. talk okay, with friends more when you feel when you feel interesting? Yes. That's very good. Okay. And write, write. Uh, for example, in English, what do you want to write in English? What What do you want to write in English? What do you want? to write, okay, in English. So think about the time that you studied before, 10 months before. Uh, how many ways that you start to write in English? But how many ways that you start to write in English? Yeah, how many ways? You think about... Sometimes. Sometimes, no, no, no. I'm not asking about how often, okay? If you answer me, sometimes, I understand that how often. Uh -huh. My question must be often. You are going to ask me always, okay? Often, okay? Or sometimes. Yeah. But here, my question is, 
want to write in your in would like story writing story writing writing letter chứ trời ơi không nghe được nữa vân 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 thôi ổn mà vân vân bị không lên rồi nó chưa cẩu nữa chú con học mấy là sao vậy đó con học lớp rồi 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 What do you want to write in English? Okay, story writing, essay writing, letter writing, email writing. We have four. We have four forms of writing in English. So, so which one do you want to write in English? What do you want to write about in English? Story. Story writing. Okay, share with me. What kind of stories do you want to write about? What kind of stories do you want to write? Uh, we have two guys, right? Real stories. Yeah. yeah. And the second one, that is ima imagination, okay? Imagination stories. Imagination stories like uh, unreal stories. You make it up. You can say that I make, okay, this is, this is, And real stories, this is unreal stories, and I make them up. I make the stories up. So, so what about imagination stories? Uh, which one is more difficult for you? But which one is more difficult for you? Which one is more difficult for you? Which one is more difficult for you? Imagination. Imagination. Okay. So here we say that imagination, imagine, imagination stories. Uh, are more difficult for you. So why? Do you, why are are you saying that you can't imagine what happens in the story? So what? You, you cannot imagine. You cannot imagine what to write in the story or what? You can't imagine what to write in the story or what? Do you think that you have good imagination skill? Uh, but imag no, no. Oh wow. Okay. Yeah. Imagination skills. So what about, have you ever imagined anything happening in your life? Like you imagine? Yes. Yes, okay, very good. So, so share with me, what do you imagine? Okay? What do you imagine in your life? What do you imagine to happen in your life? Uh, wait. Sorry? What do you... Yeah, what do you imagine to happen in your life? What do you want to happen? But in real life, it doesn't happen. So you have to imagine, okay? So here is it's yeah. like you want it, okay? You want it to happen, but okay, but in real life, it doesn't happen. It doesn't. It doesn't happen, okay? So, so you have to imagine. You have to imagine it happens. So, what do you want? Yeah. Imagine, okay, to happen in your life. Yes, you think about love, you think about friendship, you think about presence, you think about money, for example. At your age, we are going to think about love. Somebody loves to love somebody else, or somebody has crush on somebody else, but that kind of crush doesn't love us. Okay, we can imagine about that. We also can imagine about birthday present, for example. You want to have something on your birthday, but your mom doesn't okay buy you the birthday presents. So you want to imagine, okay? Oh, I want to have, I want to have. Um, like one million Vietnam dong for my birthday, but, but my mom doesn't give it to me, so I must imagine because I want to feel happy. I want to fake my feelings for one minute. So I just imagine that my mom gives me some birthday presents. So here, when you imagine something, when you imagine something, the only reason for you to imagine something because you want to fake, you want to fake 
okay? Your feelings. You want to fake your emotions, okay? You want to be like, oh, I want to feel happy, okay? For just, okay, for just a minute, for just a, for just a, mi a minute before, before I come back, okay? Before I come back to my real life. Yeah, so right here, please, bun. Think about your feelings. I want to hear you talking about something that you wanted to happen, but it doesn't happen. So you must imagine, okay, that it happens. Yes, I, I want to. I want to have a bike. Yeah. Motorbike. Yeah. But, yeah. Yeah, but 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 say say but in real life. Yes. But in real life it doesn't happen. Very good, okay. But it, it, is this a true story or this is this is you faking out the story for me? It, is it true? Is it true in your real life? Yeah no. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so so you imagine that. You, you imagine to have a motorbike, but you cannot have a motorbike. So you are going to you are going to imagine for for the very first time in your life. Very good, but and right now this is this is the brand map. You can see that wow, this is a very beautiful brand map. And here I want you to look at the the the, the branch. Okay, imagine again just like this, just like this. And here is the here's is it so please look at this again and uh, and uh, and please uh, try to think about the story and share it with me for for like one minute I'm going to wait for you to get more ideas for five minutes is it okay what I'm going to wait for you for five minutes five minutes only five minutes for you to complete this homework five minutes for you to think about the ideas and talking and talking to me so right now I'm going to Five minutes, and this is this is time. Oh, sorry, this is time. Oh, là nói về cái bức tranh hay là? No, no, no. You are going to use your imagination. You are going to use, okay to talk to talk. Okay, so here five minutes begin. Is it okay? Yes.
Bye.